FFA Today, brought to you by the Carroll County Cattlemen's Association. I'm Von Kittleson. Well, I was at the recent Nordic Fest celebration in Decorah, Northeast Iowa. The uh, members of the Decorah FFA having a, a booth there. And I spoke with their vice president, Eden Scheidel. And uh, what, what were you guys doing at Nordic Fest? So at Nordic Fest, a way to promote both Decorah FFA and the Winnesheet County Dare Promoters, we have our Moo Mobile set up to provide shakes to the public. Excellent. You do other activities throughout the year, I assume, too. Oh, yes, of course. We always have some sort of competitions. Those go throughout February and March. I personally have competed in ag communications, which is a very fun way, similar to what you're doing, actually. Different ways of going out to the public and, you know, sharing broadcasting. I've also done creed speaking, which is presenting the FFA creed. I've also done chapter website competition, which is showing off our chapter's website. There's very diverse types of competitions that definitely show off what it's like to go into the work field and, you know, at a youth level, developing those skills for the future. Oh, boy, Eden, it sounds like FFA has benefited you and you'd recommend this for other students then. Oh, yes, of course. We have many members who come in and they expect this to be all just animals and stuff like that, but then they seriously get to know what this organization is and how it promotes those kind of things for youth. And it's definitely beneficial, especially for me, not coming from a huge ag background and now coming into this, you know, getting those skills and learning new things. Definitely important. Decora FFA chapter vice president Eden Scheidel. I spoke with her at the recent Nordic Fest held in Decora in Northeast Iowa. FFA members from that chapter were very active with that festival. FFA Today brought to you by the Carroll County Cattlemen's Association. I'm Von Kettleson.